Oh okay. boy, what you making, Dad? Scary stuff. Wow, that looks pretty scary. Put your scary face on, Dad. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what about just your normal face? Or was that it? Then you're gonna go out and chase the woodchucks around. <laughs> Kill the golfers. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Cinderella story. There's <laughs> Augusta. It was just like one of the more popular uh, white chocolate, or one of the more popular um, Halloween molds. Yeah, then we put, give them red Dad, eyes. Dad, you're gonna give it away. Oh. I mean, not that it's not going to be in the thumbnail, probably. But. I did not say that. <laughs> These look like really sturdy molds. They good quality. They are the goodest. It's my vibrating table. Yeah, your hand. Learned this from the old country. Yeah. <laughs> you learned how to make uh, chocolate back in Greece. Is that where it is? Yeah. Oh, yeah, sure. Went to the Greek school of candy. They didn't call it that back then. <laughs> they called it the Boston Candy Kitchen. Voila. Voila. <laughs> All right. We can just do one more, just for the people who didn't quite catch it the first time. I know, because it is pretty. F I was going. Lightning fast. Yeah, he got you quick steep for a reason. Okay. Wanna see me fill them over? Hey, watch again. <laughs> Wanna see me <laughs> do it again? <laughs> Hush me pull a rabbit out of my hat. <laughs> Wrong hat. <laughs> the heck? Watch your language, man. <laughs> yeah, don't mean to use the it's H word, the but what the heck? <laughs> don't use the J word. Huh? The J, J word. word. Yeah, I don't know if that's a J or a G word. Oh, fiddlesticks. Man, up the F word? <laughs> Fart? You can use the F bomb? <laughs> Dropping the fiddlesticks? <laughs> oh, Look at that. Wow. That's pretty scary, huh? Yeah, oh man, I'm scared just looking at that. Also the candy. Ha! <laughs> Okay. Way to go. Way to go, me. Is that what you're saying? Way to go, me. Good job, me. <laughs> Steve, you're the greatest. You're the best. Is that just like what you say in the mirror every day? And people love you. <laughs> Are you ready? Sort of. I'm just going to grab a kettle of white chocolate. Are you ready, kids? Am I supposed to say something there? Aye, aye, Captain. I can't hear you. Aye, aye, Captain. Oh, who lives above a candy store uh, in East Syracuse? The Andrianus family. Uh, that's, the only, that's the only line I can come up with off the top of my head. Oh, I thought, I thought that was a takeoff on something, but I feel like maybe it's not. Yeah, it was just uh, our theme song. Did we have, have we always had this theme song or yes. did it just get created? Nope, it's, uh, it's always been there since like 1910 once they opened the store. They're like, well, we can't open the store until we have a theme song. The theme song's invented in 1910. Well, I this feel one like was. you're pulling my leg. No, actually, I heard that the SpongeBob theme song was based off of Hercules Candy. Oh, okay, that must be true. That's that. I feel the. I hear the ring of truth to that. Okay, yeah. Craig. Yeah. I know you wouldn't lead me yeah. astray. No, I wouldn't. I wouldn't you wouldn't do that. feed me a bill of goods. No. I would never. Never. Do you ever lie? No. 
attachment. No, never. Hey, look at that. Oh, yeah. You know what that's for, Max. Can't see it. I yeah, I know. <laughs> it's for <laughs> Oh, my God. You know, for eating? Yeah. Yes. After you practice your urban candy twisting. Pretty much everything down here is for, uh, <laughs> for eating. Can you believe it? Ribbon candy twisting. With Max. The, the fruit roll ups. With the fruit roll ups. Yeah. Can you do the twist? Like we did last time. Um, can you do the twist? No. Nope. Can't it's do too it. hard of a dance move. Yeah, I would probably put my back out, break a hip, yeah. throw on a knee, you know. It would be you bad. Like Bo. Bo? Bo knows. Bo knows. I thought Max knows. Hmm. Bo knows? See, it's, so, it's weird when you say that, too. It almost sounds like its own word. Bo knows. Bonos. Well, is, bono. is it Bono or Bono? Bono. <laughs> bono. <laughs> the lead oh, singer okay. of the YouTube. The YouTube. The YouTubes. Okay. Here we have a scary looking skull. Wow, that is scary. How can we make I it? I am frightened. How can we make it more scarier even? Dad already gave it away. I did? Dad did. I said, you're not dad. I'm not. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> Maybe one day. Okay, we'll keep it that way. I'm gonna let him keep his dad crown. Okay. I got here in my basement a kettle of white chocolate. I'm gonna use it for glue. Yeah. It's more glue color than the glue I've been using previously. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's the truth. Yep. You guys uh, having the hot glue gun, right? Just sticks of chocolate. Yeah. Yeah, right. <laughs> a, a, hot glue, a hot glue gun using chocolate. Wow, I don't know, Max. You could be onto something. Oh. You know how people like to I'm squirt the whipped chair. cream right into their mouth? They could just squirt the... <laughs> melted chocolate. Melted the chocolate mouth. right in their mouth from the hot glue gun. 200 degrees straight into your mouth. Yeah. <laughs> It'll only hurt for a minute. It looks a little cockeyed. Nobody cares. <laughs> He's supposed to be scary. Yeah. That remember scary remember the... can't see straight. <laughs> At Easter time, people were loving the crazy-eyed lambs. Yeah. There, a couple of people asked for him to be the crazier, the better. Yeah. Well, like, just covered miss one color. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 48 <You could>. eyeballs. <laughs> Actually, I bet you my bakery supply place has some uh, wacky eyeballs. <laughs> you know, like Halloween eyeballs mm -hmm, or something? Mm -hmm. I could, I could buy a box of them to put on Easter things wow. since people like stuff that's weird. <laughs> that would be kind of fun. I'll look into that some wackier sugar eyeballs. Thanks, YouTube. <laughs> Thanks for giving me the his, idea. His YouTube. name is Max, actually. Whatever. What? You're reading your texts at work? I was surprised that I got a text at work. <laughs> so I was like, did my phone just light up? <laughs> who's you, texting me? You have a phone? I know, like, right? Who's yeah. texting me? Craig's standing right here. <laughs> <laughs> I know sometimes if we're like at a family party and my phone rings, it's like, who could that be? Anybody that would be calling me is here right now. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's that's what happens when you get older. One time, Not a long, long time ago, your dad and I, we went out to dinner. Yeah? And oh, while we were out to dinner, every one of you kids called at a separate time. <laughs> one of you called because you didn't know where we were. <laughs> we were worried. We we Probably us. Leah. No, Leah called because she was in Connecticut and she was baking a cake and she didn't have a cake pan. So she wanted to know um, how long she should bake. Oh, cookie sheets worth full of cake. It wasn't Google invented by them? You guys always ask me before you ask Google. <laughs> you do. I actually heard Kara say it once. She was, look, she was looking for me. I was out on the porch. She's like, you know, let's ask mom. Mom's Google. So, yeah. <laughs> and what I call for? I don't know, Craig. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Because huh? <laughs> you missed just, me? Just I wanted to it. call and say I love you. Uh, and I you, hope you guys are having a good time. Is there anything for dinner tonight? <laughs> Can you bring me back a doggy bag? <laughs> <laughs> I've, these kids have actually texted me down here asking if anything is for dinner. <laughs> too lazy to make dinner. Not, not too lazy to get up and find out what's for dinner. <laughs> now that they're grown ups, they realize that that would be kind of frowned upon that, that I should be texting them and asking what's for dinner. Mm -hmm. It's usually the first question I ask my mom when she gets home from work. So, uh, How was your day? What are you making? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, what time does your mom get home from work? Uh, right around the same time as I. Well, probably like 5:30. Closer. 
That's like when you get out of them. Don't, don't fact so, check me on that. So it depends how quickly you can walk home. Right. Or drive yeah. if you or drove. If there's any detours. One of those four-wheeled vehicles. I feel like someday he's going to drive to work and he's going to forget that he drove. He's going to walk home. He's going to leave. <laughs> yeah. I, I did it, <laughs> you though. You did? Yeah, yeah. I wouldn't be we, I didn't walk home, though. We were upstairs and, uh, and your dad was like, Oh, the mini's outside. Is your dad here? And I was like, oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah. Easy to do. Yeah. You know. I mean, you live like, what, 700 meters away or something like that? 732 sure, meters, that. last I checked. Well, why not? Yeah. Actually, I don't think I have. Your watch could tell you, right? Like, Is your yeah, watch a distance it's, watch? It's, it's one of them there distance watches. <laughs> it's like point two something miles away, maybe. I don't know. I'll have to check the next time I run to your house, Max. Which is actually like a, you know, a couple times a week. Yeah, it might be tonight. <laughs> yeah, probably. Are you guys? Yeah, do you want to go for a run tonight? Yeah, I do. With, uh, All right, down. it's on the video. Woo. You have to now, even though by the time we go for a run, it'll be a couple days before <laughs> yeah. this video goes up. <laughs> yeah. Max, when is your half marathon? Yeah, Max. October eighth. Now it's on the video. Are you excited to be over? Are you excited yeah. for October 9th? I am excited for October 9th because that's when we go to our favorite brewery. Yeah? Yeah. So. I, mean, I don't know if you're going to be able to enjoy it though. You're going to be like walking like an old man. Like, you're going to make it feel my better. legs. Well, that's, that's, you know, the people that we go down there with, they could, well, Steve's wife is going to run this one too and she just started running like, you know, when I signed up, but Steve, Steve will run 13 miles for fun, you know yeah. what I mean, in the morning. And we know people like that. <laughs> yeah. Do you? Yeah. Have you guys ever That's met a runner? That's what I used to do yeah. back in the day. Yeah. <laughs> but then he'll be ready to, to drink after that, so yeah. I'm just worried that after the marathon they're going to be like, okay, you guys want to go get some beers? And I'll be like, blah! You know, like, <laughs> no. <laughs> we'll yeah. See. Viva C. Gatorade. <laughs> what? <laughs> he'll want Gatorade. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I thought you, were doing you guys it. used to it's try water. to convince water me. Water sucks. <laughs> it really, really <laughs> sucks. Gatorade. <laughs> okay. You guys used to try to convince me that chocolate milk was the best recovery drink. Oh, that, that's what marketing, uh, the marketing from the dairy industry will tell you. Okay, that's what Just you so that they can sell dairy. more chocolate that's milk. You told me. Yeah. You're choking on flour, man. <laughs> <laughs> that's awful. You know, she told that's, me. That's what, like, pretty much everybody, you know, it's pretty much, like, common knowledge in... Um, stuff. Really? In like athletic pursuits and stuff, people be like, "Oh, I gotta make sure I drink my chocolate milk after." Chocolate milk. Yeah. Not even regular milk. No. Chocolate milk. No. I think it's because uh, the dairy industry wanted to like promote it, and then they're like, "Hey, well, hey, if we say it's chocolate milk, people will be like, oh, well, I'll twist my arm. I gotta drink my <laughs> chocolate yeah. milk after yeah. I work out. You know, it's yeah. just irresponsible if I don't. Like It'd be like if if we were like, you know, chocolate covered potato chips are really great for after you're done working out. People are like, oh, jeez, you know, it'd be it yes, just I wouldn't be a good workout like if I didn't people, eat chocolate some potato Some people with red exactly. wine. Yeah. yeah. Oh okay. man, it'd just be unhealthy if I, I don't see drink it. Where you're coming red from? Red wine and dark. Guys. Yeah. Like dark so, yep. Yeah. And that's why people like hearing too that like bacon is good for you because like oh man I gotta eat my bacon today. Who would believe that? Yeah. <laughs> Who has ever eaten like half a pound of bacon and not been like I can feel my heart pumping slower? <laughs> 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 Literally dying right now. <laughs> You guys remember that when I first started working here? And I would wake up, make myself like four fried eggs and a pound of bacon. Oh yeah. We remember yeah. how would we I, yeah, I don't I remember I what you, you ate for breakfast that. before you came here. I don't know. I remember discussing it with oh, you. Okay. You know, would be like, yeah, I really don't feel good. <laughs> so now you, now you're just like eating nothing when you come to work. Is that correct? Yeah, it's even better. No, I, <laughs> I usually have a banana, couple of pieces Max? of fruit. Come on, have a banana. I eat at least an apple on the walk over. Okay. Have a banana, Max. Makes banana you feel Max. better. <laughs> got some popsicles in my basement. Wait, did you did you get that reference? Uh, I wasn't sure. It, kind it was, of it like, was the like old a really family. old YouTube video. I think um, it was shoes. Oh my Let's God! Some really? Shoes. They're like, have some whiskey. Makes <laughs> you, you feel expect? better. Yeah. I don't know what y'all are talking about. <laughs> Really old YouTube videos. Okay. Yeah, it's a really, really weird YouTube video. Oh, do they have those? YouTube weird? was even weirder than it is now, back then. They have uh, weird YouTube yeah, videos? Actually, I don't know. It's a, maybe a different type of weird. Yeah, different type of weird. <laughs> <laughs> or as uh, Ethan, e Elon, e Ethan and Ethan. Ela, they call it cringe tube back in the day. 
Because I guess all the videos were just bad. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. 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 This is how you, you make white skulls even more scarier, even. What was that? <laughs> wow. All right, I have to trim. See that? Yeah, I do. Don't go on there. No. You gonna cut them up? Just a oh, little really bit. Huh? Yeah. Do that. Put it in a bag like that. Yeah. Then we walk over here. Oh. What's that? I, I heard music playing, so I was gonna. I was gonna turn it off, and then I think I pressed the you a button wiggle. to print something. Did you, go over here? <laughs> Did you see this? Is it hot? It says it's hot. Didn't you guys have to write that because somebody burned themselves or something? Yeah, somebody touched it. And you seal it. Can you do it again so there's no interruptions this time when I'm accidentally printing a label? We have to trim this so we cut it. Cut it like how? Cut it like this. See that? Mm -hmm. And then there's a little, if there's any little shavings. You gotta get rid of the evidence? Yeah. You good at getting rid of the evidence, Karen? Put it in the no bag. Comment. Then we walk over here. How important are the hand movements? Important. Wow, that does sound important. This is hot. And then you just screw this around until it seals it. Isn't it called a ferret sealer or something? And there you go. Wow. Got a hole in its nostril. Yeah. Can't it still can breathe out one side. <laughs> and then what do you do? I have to weigh it. Yeah. Let me see. Let me see. Close. Uh -huh. Oh, I didn't hear it hit. No. And it takes a red sticker. Mm-hmm. Because it's white chocolate. Mm-hmm. Okay. And a red pen. To make red it. eyes. And you put in one. Point two five. That's the way. One ounce. One pound. One ounce. One pound, 25 can't ounces. Be. What the? <laughs> what the? Uh, what the? What the hay?